To simplify your journeys on motorways and main roads, new Renault Clio is fitted with adaptive cruise control. Using a camera and a radar, it allows you to keep your vehicle at the speed of your choice and to maintain an ideal tracking distance from the vehicle in front of you. If the tracking distance decreases and is no longer sufficient, your vehicle will then slow down without any action on your part on the brake pedal. When the tracking distance becomes sufficient again, your vehicle will reset itself to the cruise speed that you had defined. To benefit from this function, activate the Adaptive Cruise Control by pressing this button. Press this same button to deactivate it. Once the driving assistance has been activated, this warning light appears in the instrument panel. The function is operational and you need to program a cruise speed. To do this at a steady speed, use one of these buttons. Your current speed will then become the cruise speed. You can change the cruise speed at any time by pressing this switch to increase the value and this one to reduce it. Press and hold to change it in steps of 6 miles per hour or 10 kilometers per hour. You will then be able to adjust a tracking distance by pressing this switch repeatedly. The four horizontal tracking bars indicate the desired distance. One bar for a short distance corresponding to a tracking time of approximately 1.2 seconds. Two bars for intermediate distances with respective tracking times of around 1.6 and 2 seconds. Finally, one bar for a long distance equivalent to a tracking time of 2.4 seconds. Note that you are unable to not choose a tracking distance and so to use the adaptive cruise control like conventional cruise control. When you have programmed the distance, you can remove your foot from the accelerator and brake pedal while remaining focused on the traffic. If the camera and the radar detect a vehicle in front, this will appear on the instrument panel. The tracking distance will then be maintained and your vehicle will brake if the distance is insufficient to maintain the cruise speed. When the safety distance is no longer observed, the distance bar flashes. You can pause the adaptive cruise control at any time during your journey. To do this, simply select this button. The cruise speed and the tracking distance are then memorized and the display on the instrument panel will be grayed out. You can also pause the system by pressing the brake pedal. To restart the adaptive cruise control, first ensure that the road and traffic conditions are suitable. Then press this button. The speed is displayed again with the warning light. If the preset speed is higher than your current speed, your vehicle will accelerate to reach the cruise speed. You can, of course, exceed the selected speed for overtaking, for example. To do this, simply press the accelerator pedal. The limited speed will then flash in red on the instrument panel. To return to the cruise speed, slow down. The adaptive cruise control will be triggered again as soon as the cruise speed is reached. If the detected vehicle appears in yellow and a single beep is emitted, the system is indicating to you that you must be vigilant and therefore prepare to act. If this image accompanied by a continuous beep appears, you must react immediately to avoid the risk, because the adaptive cruise control is not able to brake sufficiently to avoid it. Note that the adaptive cruise control operates differently depending on whether your new Renault Clio has a manual or automatic gearbox. With a manual gearbox, the function is operational after having been activated between 18 and 105 miles per hour or 30 and 170 kilometers per hour, and it is maintained when you change gear. With an automatic gearbox, you also have the stop and go function. The adaptive cruise control is then operational between 0 and 105 miles per hour or 170 kilometers per hour once activated. With the stop and go adaptive cruise control, you benefit from real assistance when driving in traffic jams. When the vehicle ahead of you slows down and stops before moving off again, your new Renault Clio is able to do the same without any action from you on the pedals.
If the vehicle in front of you restarts in under 3 seconds, your new Renault Clio restarts automatically. If the restart takes place between 3 seconds and 3 minutes, simply tap the accelerator or this button to reactivate the cruise control and its stop and go system. Important! After 3 minutes, the adaptive cruise control will be deactivated and the electronic parking brake will be applied. You will then have to restart the function. For your comfort, the adaptive cruise control with stop and go is perfectly compatible with stop and start and the electronic parking brake. Finally, note that the adaptive cruise control is dedicated to driving on motorways and main roads. It is an additional driving aid and must not replace your vigilance as a driver. Generally speaking, always adapt your speed to the traffic conditions irrespective of the system's indications. To ensure the correct operation of this driving aid, ensure that the windscreen, camera and radar are maintained and kept clean. The function may be temporarily disrupted when the visibility of the road is poor or if it includes hairpin bends. Important! You must deactivate the adaptive cruise control if you are towing a trailer. Finally, note that the camera and radar only detect vehicles moving in the same direction as you. In addition, the function does not detect animals that could cross the road or barriers at the side of the road. Always remain vigilant when you are driving. You now know all of the benefits of the adaptive cruise control technology designed for your comfort and your peace of mind on the road. Have a good trip! Happy driving with new Renault Clio!